y'all. Welcome to Horse Range Mountain Farm. Today we're going to be making burritos that we can stick in the freezer so on those hectic mornings when you're running around like a chicken with your head cut off, you can just pull them out, stick them in the oven, and it's quick, fast, and easy. So come along and let's get to cooking. So first things first, we're going to put a little bit of olive oil in the bottom of our iron skillet and we're going to heat it up. So now I'm just going to break each egg open and then I'm going to mix them all together. And this is really good to do, especially if you have a lot of eggs coming in. So then you can go ahead and make meals with it. They don't go to waste. And you can stick them in your freezer. So now we're just gonna add a little bit of pepper. Or for some people that might be a lot of pepper, but it's okay. And then a little bit of salt. Now we're just gonna stir it up. I'm used to doing it with a fork, so. Now we're gonna go over here to our hot iron skillet and pour them in. All right, so now we're gonna pour in the eggs. Now I'm just gonna stir them as they cook because I do not like scorched eggs. I probably should have poured this in a little bit bigger iron skillet, but it's okay. Now I'm just gonna cook them until the eggs aren't slimy. Because we like our eggs good and done. But not scorched. And the worst smell is a scorched egg. I cannot handle the smell of that. It smells horrible to me. Now I'm going to set this aside. Now I've got some turkey sandwich meat that I'm going to cut up and I'm just going to heat it up a little bit, which if you're not going to eat any right away, you could just mix it in with your eggs and then roll it into the tortilla shells and then freeze. But I'm going to go ahead and heat mine up. Now I do turkey in mine and Nathan likes ham in his. And you can also put bacon in it, sausage. And I've got a little bit of sausage left from Nathan's um, breakfast this morning. So I'm going to mix some sausage in with his ham and put in his. 
And also we're gonna add some chives that I have frozen from the garden from this summer. And what I did to make my chives is I just cut the tops of the onions and then I flash froze them and then I stuck them in little Ziploc bags and stuck them in the freezer. I'm also gonna add some peppers that I froze out of my garden. I cut them up and then I flash froze them just like I did the chives and I've actually got videos on those. You can go over and check those out. I'll try to put a link in the description below and then it's really good for like making omelets and I think I say that even on the video. So, so I'm gonna go ahead and put my turkey in. And y'all, it's so funny, this stove, we used a glass top stove and it was electric. And so every time we lean up against this stove, it sounds like this. And we think we're getting <laughs> electrocuted because it sounds like our electric fences. So now that I got my turkey heating up, I'm gonna do Nathan's ham. And then of course I've got his sausage right here that's left over from this morning's breakfast. And you can add even more stuff to these burritos. It's just whatever your preference is and however you like your burritos. It makes life a lot easier in the morning times. I should have got a longer knife, really. Alrighty. Let's put this ham over here in this one. Like I said, if you're gonna stick these in the freezer, there's really no sense in eating them up unless you're gonna eat some right away. And it is already pre-cooked, so it's no big deal. So we're cheating a little bit today because we're using store-bought tortillas. Let me get this sausage because I gotta add it in with this pan. Now you could add the peppers and onions in with this as you're cooking it, but I'm just gonna add them to the eggs. I have to do mine separate because Nathan doesn't like peppers in his. So right here, I'm just gonna saute some of these chives for Nathan's because he doesn't like the peppers. And then I'll do my peppers and onions in this pan after I get his done. Nathan's chives are done, so I'm gonna take them off so I don't burn them. So Nathan's gonna show you how to assemble them. All right, so first of all, we're gonna take our eggs. Sausage, some more ham and sausage. Some of the chives. Some cheese. 
can just grab these like this, fold the sides in a little bit, just keep folding in as you go. So now we're just going to take these and wrap them in aluminum foil. And then I'll label them for Nathan and stick them in the freezer. And then whenever he wants one in the morning, he can just pop it in the oven. Y'all don't forget to hit that like, share, and subscribe, and come back for more videos. Thanks for watching, and have a blessed day.